Hello everyone, Kimberly Crawford here and I am so excited to share a great technique with you that creates a beautiful look of bronze like I have here on my die cut shape. It's shiny and metallic and trendy and absolutely beautiful. And how I created that look was using these perfect pearls from Ranger. These are um, a pigmented powder and they leave a metallic finish behind and they are pretty great and they're really easy to use. So what I did is I cut some tropical teal cardstock with the largest hexagon die from the Modern Plus Marbled kit. What I'm going to do is use this perfect medium to stamp my images on. Now, if you don't have perfect medium, you can also use a watermark ink. That also works really well, but today I'm going to use this perfect medium. I'm going to apply it to my sentiment. And this thank you is from the Modern Plus Marbled kit as well. The perfect medium goes on just like regular ink. In fact, it's clear. Uh, you can hardly see it just like watermark and it is going to hold the powders. I don't think one or the other holds the powders better. Uh, I think they both hold the powder quite nicely. So whatever you happen to have on hand will work perfectly. I'm going to stamp my image and it's going to leave behind the image like a uh, watermark or a tone on tone result. I'm going to use some scratch paper underneath because I'm going to apply the Perfect Pearl powders to my stamped image. Using a small brush, I'm going to pick up a little bit of the powder and you can see just a very little bit on the end of the brush and apply it over the stamped image just brushing it in place and pushing the pigment powders around. As you can see over the end there, it isn't as bright and it isn't as dark. So, or shiny, I guess would be the better way to describe that, it doesn't have the luster. And so what I'll do is I will go back and just add a little bit more powder. I will continue to spread those powders around. Once I've covered my image, I'm going to take a larger brush and just buff off those extra bits of powder on there. There might be a little bit of shine left behind, but that's all right. And here you go. Look at how beautiful the results of that are. Simple and easy. I'm going to do the same thing again with this marble image. And this marble image is also from the Modern Plus Marbled Kit, and it creates this amazing marbled background. I've applied the perfect medium to my stamped image, and I'm going to go ahead and stamp this image. Once again, I'm going to stamp the image around the bottom. And I love how this um, marbling shape can work around the sentiments and fill in backgrounds and patterns. The powders are being applied to that perfect medium in the stamped image again. And once I have enough coverage, I'll take that large brush and once again buff it off. And there are the beautiful results there. And here's the card that I put this panel upon. And you can see how elegant and classy this look is. Another way you can use these pearl powders is not just with the inks, but also with adhesive. You could use score tape like I have here, red line tape, or even just a basic adhesive runner that you might happen to have on hand. All of these, the powders will stick to. I'm going to create a random background on my card stack panel here. And once again, I'm using tropical teal. I'll place the adhesive down and trim away the excess. I'm going to scratch just the end of the backing and pull it away easily to expose my adhesive. I'm doing this because I'm going to layer the adhesive over top of one another. And if I leave the backings on, that's going to make it very difficult to remove. There I've completed my modern background. And once again, I'm going to brush on my powders. I did find with these powders that I needed a little bit more powder when I was using the adhesive versus the perfect medium. I'm going to brush away the extra with that big brush again. And one thing I wanted to show you is I wiped the surface off with a paper towel and I want you to see how little actually comes off of your project. It's very easy to do. And one last cool little tip I wanted to show you, um, using the thank you die from the Modern Plus Marble Kit, um, I die cut the words thank you and I just use some um, Canyon Clay cardstock. I'm going to cover the words with this perfect medium and how I can tell the word is covered it got darker. So the tone of the cardstock changed and I could tell that it was completely covered in the medium. Once I got the words covered in the medium, I went back in with my brush and applied the perfect pearls over the entire surface of the word. I think the results are absolutely beautiful. Look at how shiny this is and how metallic and beautiful. So there you go. A couple of ways to create the bronze look on your next card. Have fun making things bronze.